Okay. Overall energy, ace of swords in reverse. I thought there is a resistance for communication, okay, from one of you or both of you, okay, but there, this is creating a lot of confusion here for both of you, all right? Things are at a complete halt. There is just no breakthrough in this relationship, okay? So no communication looks like the theme out here. Nine of wands in reverse here. You could be dealing, you, you could be someone very in and out of this person's life, all right, because that's what's on your mind, or you're just being very inconsistent and reliable and unsincere when it comes to your offer with this person. Yes, you are very passionate about them, okay, but you're not taking a correct approach towards them, okay? That's why there's a lack of forward movement from your side. Eight of Cups in reverse here. This person looks like they're very, very emotionally invested into you, okay? They've tried to walk away from you, but they can't. They're coming back. Two of Cups, you love them. And you know they love you too. That's the best part. Knight of Cups in their feelings. This is the lover boy here, okay? Lover boy, lover girl. This is someone who is deeply in love with you, okay? And they want to offer you the world, okay? Someone who wants to offer you... Uh, give you a love offer or uh, some kind of committed love emotional offer, okay? Mutual energy, 10 of pentacles in reverse. There is this lack of stability, security within the relationship. I wouldn't be surprised with the knight of wands here, okay? Now, you feel free to switch the energies, okay? This could definitely be their side and this could definitely be you. Take it how it resonates. Because energies can be reversible. All right. Tell me why is the eight of ace of swords in reverse here as the current situation? Ten of wands, nine of wands in reverse, five of pentacles. Yep, you said screw it because this was becoming a big burden to you, okay? It was a relationship which makes you very happy, gets you very, very emotional, very emotionally fulfilling. But you have done this with this person over and over and over again, okay? You've done it like a hundred times, repeating the same pattern. You're exhausted, burnt out. You could have held on to this relationship probably for um, nine months, okay? Nine weeks, whatever. But you finally gave up, okay? You were like, screw it, I cannot do this anymore. And because of which there's been a separation or a breakup, you're feeling very lonely and isolated in this relationship or this could be the person you're dealing with. But definitely looks like this was something that was a big um, overwhelming energy for you, okay? It was too much work because you were doing everything on your own and this person didn't really do anything. <coughs> All right, Eight of Cups, Knight of Wands in reverse, please. Let's see, why is the Knight of Wands in reverse? Oh, that card slipped. Just give me a second. The Knight of Wands slipped out, but I'm not going to take it, okay? Give me two more cards. Okay, so, sweetheart, Three of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles in reverse, and the Emperor in reverse. Your problem here is that you're not putting in a lot of effort, okay? You're not putting a lot of work. I'm getting... <laughs> You want to work on a partnership with this person, okay? You want to build with this person here. You could be very, very fed up and tired of this person because this is someone who just drags a connection, okay? They're too slow moving, okay? Too slow moving. Like when they were with you in the relationship, it was still very slow, right? But now it's just too slow, okay? Literally, like you could be dying. You could just feel so fucked with, okay? And with the Emperor in reverse here, you're dealing with someone, you know, who's just... And a control freak. This is someone who's my way or the highway. They think this is the right way to deal with a relationship and that's how they're doing it. This is someone very hard to budge. You could be putting in a lot of effort. You were very consistent with this person, okay? But now you're fed up. You're exhausted and you're not putting in any more work. You're open to the idea of working with this person. Yes, but right now, you've completely pulled back your energies, okay? You're not interested in working with them right now because you've given up on this situation. Eight of Cups in reverse. This person could have walked away from you. But they're coming back. Coming back, why? To put in the work, to put in the effort, to put in their 100%. Eight of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, Yabebe and the world. Here they are, coming back. Brace for impact. This person wants a brand new passionate beginning with you, okay? For the world here, they do see as things ending, but they want to start a brand new cycle with you, okay? The world is also where, you know, they know things have ended, but this also looks to me as someone who feels like you are the world to them, okay? They see you as their world. They see you as completing them, okay? And they're ready to put in their work, okay? That's where they're coming back. Okay. Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups, please. Clarify the Knight of Cups. Okay, 
That was two cards? No, one more card. Hmm. The Knight of Cups is clarified by the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands in reverse. Five of Wands and the Empress in reverse. They definitely see you as someone who's not nurturing this connection. Okay? They don't. I feel that this is definitely someone here, okay, who's trying to grow, okay, they are. But the thing out here is that, uh, I think this is the Queen of Wands, they see you as the Queen of Wands in reverse. They see you as someone who's lacking the motivation to invest into this relationship. That's what I said, right? You're pulling away. You're no more giving this that passionate approach. You know, the Queen of Wands is all about action, right? You're not taking action, which is causing a lot of conflict in this person's head, okay, with the Five of Wands here. I feel they want to express how they feel, okay? They are in their feelings, they want to. But there's this constant conflict, okay? Either this is someone, you know, who feels that there's a lot of drama and chaos when it comes to this relationship. Either there is too much interference here, okay? But with the Empress in Reverse here, they feel this is a situation that is not being nurtured by you, okay? Or you, you just feel it's a situation that's going nowhere. But that's because probably they are not taking that proper approach towards you. Or this could be you who's not putting in that effort. You have a very passive approach towards them, you know. All you used to make shit happen, now you're letting shit happen. Can I have the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, please? Why is this a mutual energy? All right, so... Sweetheart, both of y'all, four of wands, page of six of cups in reverse and the page of swords in reverse here. There's no action, baby. There's no action. You're both just trying to look at each other, spying, watching, everything from a distance. But when it comes to communication, when it comes to expressing yourself, saying the truth, both of you are holding back because this is the mutual energy or at least one of you is doing it more, okay? Because of which it's leaving a bad taste in your mouth. Could be you, could be them, could be both of y'all, all right? This withdrawing, of uh, communication or not being able to express themselves, right? This is frustrating the other person here. Both of you want the four of wands, okay? You both want that commitment. You both want to be in this relationship. You both think long term, okay? That's what you want. But it's the communication. It's that lack of expression, okay? That is stopping you both. Six of cups in reverse gives me two things, okay? One, either this lack of communication is... Uh, Making the other person hold a grudge against this, okay? Because there have been a lot of past bitter memories that you've had within the relationship. Or there is one person here who's gone through a bad past, who's gone through a bad relationship because of which they have that fear of commitment, okay? Someone could have really screwed them over because of which they're not being able to trust and have faith about uh, wanting to label things, okay? But the intention is there, okay? Four of Wands, it's there. You both want this long term. At least if you decide, this is you, Leo, if you don't believe they do, they don't want it with you, they do. They do. Uh, what action will Leo take towards this person? Please make a move. Please make a move. Great. Start in reverse. Want you to come out. You're both losing faith and hope in a connection. Remember one thing. Whoever's losing faith and hope, right? This is a testing time. Something's going to happen at the right time, okay? But this is, the you know, universe testing your patience. You're seeing how bad you want it. What's the likely outcome for Leo and love? So what's the likely outcome? Nice. All right. The star five. You're, you're, you're letting this go. Nine of wands in reverse here. You're fed up. This was also the overall energy. Okay? We have the nine of wands in reverse twice. You're fed up of doing the same, repeating the pattern. You have a lot of love for this person. Okay. No denial. But I feel that you want this as an equal partnership. Okay. You want them to invest into you emotionally as much as you do. Okay. Because you definitely see them as someone who's a control freak, someone who doesn't express their feelings. They like to throw their weight around, you know, um, whatever, you know. But someone who just lacks structure, okay? They don't know how to do it the right way. Nine of Wands in reverse. No. Tell me why is the Four of Swords? Their action they take towards you is the Four of Swords. Well, no action is also action, right? They're thinking a lot about you, but they're not doing anything about it. Why is the Four of Swords here? All right, baby doll. 
Ace of Swords with the Page of Pentacles in reverse and the Six of Wands. All right. This person is definitely wanting to communicate. That's what they're thinking about. Okay. With the Four of Soldier, they're trying to heal. They want to come in with the truth. They want to clarify. They want a breakthrough. Okay. And with the Six of Wands, they want to move forward with you. But what I'm getting here is that this person is someone who's just not ready to invest right now. They're holding back that investment. Okay. They feel they can't deal with the situation right now because they're waiting for the right moment. You're probably dealing with a perfectionist or just dealing with someone who feels for everything to be right. You know, when they feel right, that's when they do it. But because of that, sometimes this can be a missed opportunity. Okay. Which is why you're giving up on waiting for them. However, page of cups, I do see communication coming in. I guess they will finally um, communicate with you. What's the page of cups? Looks like an apology to me. What's the page of cups? Okay. The fool in reverse. King of swords in reverse. Can you have more cards? That's very weird energy. Nine of cups in reverse. Okay. <clears throat> the cards are so contradictory, the clarifications. Ha. Huh. Okay. Alright, sweet up. What's happening here is the fool in reverse, king of swords in reverse, and the nine of cups in reverse here. There is a situation here, okay, where this person is going to make a very reckless move towards you, okay? They're going to act without thinking because they cannot hold back anymore, okay? Because in their emotions, their feelings, their mind, it's screaming that they want you, okay? They're coming back with a purpose here, all right? But when it comes to the fool in reverse here, I feel this is someone who's very impulsive, okay? They're just acting without thinking. They're not making a proper approach or proper communication because we have the king of swords in reverse here. So when they're coming in, they're again coming in with that kind of manipulative energy where you're just not going to feel satisfied nine of cups in reverse here there's that emotional dissatisfaction here okay when this person comes in yes they are coming in with emotional communication could be apology but it's like sorry no sorry something like that okay sorry but not sorry yeah that's what i meant that's what they're doing and because of the nine of cups in reverse here i feel this person's very unhappy without you so it's an unhappiness without you that's pushing them to come towards you but they're still not coming in with that right approach okay it's again it's a very hasty decision that they're making Okay, because six of wands is a very determined energy, right? Like, I want to make this happen. But the page of pentacles in reverse is the reason why they're still in that king of swords in reverse. They don't feel they're ready to make this investment towards you, but they still want to keep you with them because they're afraid you'll walk away. If you understand what I'm saying. Okay, that's what I have for you, Leos. I hope this reading resonates with you. Leave your comments below. Do like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.